Picture this. You're a teenager, your whole life ahead of you, with the world as your playground. But what if all that potential was ripped away from you in an instant? What if you were sentenced to spend the rest of your life behind bars with no hope of ever seeing the outside world again? The crushing blow of a judge's gavel as they pronounce your fate, condemning you to a life of captivity. It's a heart-wrenching reality that many teens have faced and today will witness their raw and emotional reactions to the news that will change their lives forever. Get ready to experience a roller coaster of emotions as we dive into the world of 10 teens reacting to their sentences. Number 10. Dylan's fate hangs in the balance as he stands before the judge accused of the unthinkable crime of murdering a sweet, innocent child. Despite overwhelming evidence against him, Dylan tries to plead his innocence, claiming that he didn't mean to kill the child. But the court sees through his lies and his desperate attempts to win over the jury fall flat. The prosecution presents damning evidence, including texts to his mother in which he hopes to manipulate the jury's emotions by crying on purpose. It's a heart-wrenching and tragic story that ends with Dylan's conviction and a life sentence behind bars. Number 9. Nicholas Lindsay's story is one of shocking twists and turns. At the tender age of his apprehension, he was deemed too young to receive a life sentence. Yet, as fate would have it, he was ultimately sentenced to a lifetime of incarceration. The judge's pronouncement of his sentence was met with a jaw-dropping response from Nicholas himself, who sat there with a sinister grin on his face, showing no trace of remorse for his heinous crimes. And if that wasn't enough, his own mother simply shrugged and declared, it is what it is, as she walked out. This is a tale of justice gone awry, of a criminal who appears to revel in his punishment, and of a family who seems to have given up on him. Number 8. Appearances can be deceiving, as is the case with Philip Chime. Despite his youthful consonants, he stands in court accused of the heinous crime of murdering his teacher. To make matters worse, the victim was a mere 24-year-old just embarking on her career and the promise of a bright future. But in a tragic turn of events, her life was cut short in a blink of an eye. Philip's fate was sealed with a life sentence, leaving everyone wondering what his reaction would be. Would he show remorse for his actions or perhaps express sorrow for the loss of life? Alas, it was not to be. The courtroom witnessed his stoic and unemotional response to the verdict, leaving many to wonder what could have driven this young man to commit such a terrible act. Number 7. The sentencing of a teenager can be a tense and emotional affair and this case was no exception. As the verdict was read out, the accused's facade of composure crumbled and he broke down in tears. In a moment of vulnerability, he begged the officers not to take him away, showing that he at least had some sense of the gravity of his actions. It was a raw and poignant display of remorse, leaving those present wondering what led this young person to commit such a crime in the first place. The courtroom was left with a sense of unease as everyone contemplated the heavy toll of youthful mistakes. Number 6. This next teen story is one that will make your blood run cold. Along with his girlfriend, he robbed and killed an elderly lady in a crime gone horribly wrong. The victim was completely defenseless, and yet they showed no mercy. As the teen sat in court, he smiled and laughed, showing no signs of remorse for his actions. In a disturbing turn of events, he even fell asleep during his sentencing, chuckling and yawning in the face of the consequences of his actions. Despite his attorney's plea for a glimmer of hope in the form of a possibility of parole, the judge delivered a harsh sentence, condemning the defendant to life in prison without any chance of release. This means he will spend the rest of his days behind bars paying the price for his inexcusable crime. It's a cautionary tale of the dangers of apathy and the consequences of senseless violence. Number 5. Jodi Arias' story is one of chilling premonition and tragic outcomes. Her ex-boyfriend had famously uttered the disturbing words, quote, Don't be surprised if one of these Sundays I don't show up and you find me dead in some place. Sadly, this proved to be all true when Jody murdered him, leading to her sentencing to life in prison. 
The eerie coincidence of her ex-boyfriend's foreboding words coming to fruition is truly spine-tingling. Despite the severity of her crime, the court noted that Jody had no prior criminal history. Number 4. This next teen's crime is beyond comprehension. He and a friend killed his own grandmother with a hatchet. The brutality of the act is truly disturbing. Despite the overwhelming evidence against him, the teen still tried to deflect blame, claiming that the news had twisted the facts. However, he was found guilty and sentenced to life in prison. His emotions were unpredictable in court. At times, he seemed remorseful, wiping away tears from his face. But then he would smirk and shake his head when the prosecutor spoke as if the gravity of his actions had no impact on him. He read only a few words from his own statement, further cementing the impression that he was in denial of the heinous nature of his crime. Number 3. TJ's crimes were heinous, having taken the lives of three of his fellow high school students. Such an act would have been enough to earn him the label of a serial killer and yet he showed no remorse for his actions. During his sentencing, he wore a white t-shirt with the word killer boldly written on it, a disturbing display of his twisted psyche. Despite being sentenced to life in prison without any possibility of parole, TJ Lane managed to escape from the Allen County Correctional Center just a year after his conviction. He fled with another inmate, Clifford Apperud, who was later captured. The search for Lane was massive and with good reason. Witnesses recalled his dead silence as he entered a crowded cafeteria and started shooting, leaving a trail of devastation in his wake. It's a tale of unfathomable cruelty and a reminder of the dangerous individuals that may lurk among us. Number 2. This next teen's sentencing was marked by a tragic event. He had started a fire that led to the death of an innocent teenager, a mistake that cost a life and left another ruined. However, the teen showed remorse for his actions and was seen crying and praying as a verdict was delivered. His sorrowful reaction was a reminder of the grave consequences of impulsive decisions and the value of learning from one's mistakes. Ultimately, this is a story of loss, regret, and the possibility of redemption. Number 1. This video has become infamous for capturing the moment when a teenager almost laughs as he is sentenced for the murder of a 23-year-old. The victim's mother is overcome with grief, unable to speak to the jury as her sister stands in for her. The contrast between the emotional devastation of the victim's family and the teen's nonchalant attitude is jarring. When given the opportunity to speak for himself, the teen offers only a few words. Do these teenagers deserve the punishment for their crimes? Leave us a comment, share with a friend on Facebook, WhatsApp, and Twitter. Stay safe out there, guys. Peace.